Uh, welcome to the Botanical Conservatory. My name is Ernesto Sandoval. I'm the manager slash curator of this facility. Um, we are primarily a teaching facility for the university, a collection, collection of plants from all over the world for uh, teaching purposes. We're here in the main tropical room of the conservatory where um, we have cycads over on this side, plants that were, were around when the dinosaurs were around. Um, and there's actually one right over here that's, that's actually, the, leaf, the leaves are coming out right now, really beautiful. Uh, over here we have chocolate, uh, the plant that makes, uh, actually it's Theoborma cacao, uh, the plant that makes chocolate, where chocolate is made from. So there's a bunch of fruits right here, and sometimes when we do tours, we actually cut them open and show them to people. In fact, I think I have one right here with the Ooh. fruit out, so nice. it's kind of fun. We had some kids in here the other day. And then, uh, uh, we had somebody uh, back here that from a, a, a greenhouse company back east that provides all sorts of rare plants in the world, and he saw this and he's like, wow, you guys are growing this? This is called Osa. It's a member of the coffee family. And I always joke that it's Osa cool, <laughs> giant flower. And then, you know, we like to connect people oh, to the world of biology. Yeah. yeah, and it's this one that where the, the there's a moth that has a long tongue like that that uh, if I you on with your tongue, I'll roll you up. And when it gets to the flower, it unrolls it and wiggles it all the way up in there and to pollinate it. So um, it's pretty cool. We, we, we like to connect plants to the rest of the biological world because, again, they're kind of the foundation of all, all, all living things on the world in the world for the most part. Why have a greenhouse uh, for teaching purposes here at the university? Well, we're in a temperate zone, uh, the Mediterranean zone here in California. And so uh, we have a lot of tropical plants in this greenhouse that need protection from the cold. By having the greenhouses and then uh, broken up into separate rooms, all of a sudden we can pretty much grow something from every climatic zone in, in the world. We welcome anybody that has an inkling uh, of an interest in plants because we have a lot of cool stuff and a little bit of something for everybody. So uh, the sun is always shining in here uh, throughout the year and it's always a nice somewhere between about 65 and 80 degrees Fahrenheit, so um, the client's nice, come visit. <laughs>